I am a mocha mom and I am back because I've been having such a good time on Pinterest with the images that are out there showing how truly glamorous and versatile natural hair really is. Whenever a special occasion came up, I was stressed out trying to figure out what I could do to match my glammed up image dress makeup with my hair. It just didn't seem to go together and I think part of that reason is because I wasn't seeing those type of images out there. But now on Pinterest you can see models fully made up, everyday people fully made up and celebrities with full out froze, chunky froze, twist out, braid out and how those methods have changed. You know, I was blown away to see people doing geometric designs when they set their hair in twists and braids so that, you know, after you take out a twist out, sometimes you could still see the parting, but now you're looking at a beautiful geometric design and it's on purpose. It's exciting. It's exciting. Back in the day, it just wasn't there. And I have to give out a shout out to Rushni, who is also known as Glamazini because she was one of the first people to have an online journal where she shared pictures of her natural hair and she let us know what she was thinking about it. But the thing that stayed with me the most was, you know, when I was struggling with my self-image, my hair was always first and foremost in my mind, you know. And a lot of times it was a problem for me, but she she had natural, she was a person living with her natural hair, just like anybody else. I'm excited about what this means for my daughters, and I'm planning to be even more purposeful in allowing them to have these images so that they know, you know, your hair is appropriate, and however, and you can style it to fit whatever situation that you're in.